So this is a video on how to set up your Sutton email on an iPhone with an IMAP connection. When you check your email with an IMAP connection, you're accessing and managing your email directly from the server. So when you delete an email from your smartphone, when you have it with an IMAP connection, um, that email will also be deleted on the server and will be deleted permanently. So we're going to go ahead and start um, the IMAP settings. So you would first tap on settings on your iPhone and then you would scroll down to mail contacts and calendars which is here. You tap on that and then you would tap on add account. Um, scroll down and tap on other and then up top you tap on add mail account right here and then in the name section you fill out your name as you wanted it to appear on emails to your clients and whoever you email so uh, mine is Sutton support Sutton support and then you enter your full email address so it would be support at Sutton.com for me Make sure you enter your full email address there. And then you want to enter your password. Um, and I'm going to enter mine right now. Okay. And then the description will automatically come up as Sutton. You can just leave that as is. Um, and once everything is correct on there, you will tap on next on the top right corner here. Tap on next. And then you want to make sure under these settings, the first thing you check is IMAP is selected. So IMAP needs to be selected in blue. If it's not already, just make sure you tap on it and select it and it will become blue. Um, you want to make sure you fill out the incoming mail server, which is secure, S-E-C-U-R-E -E dot email, E-M-A-I-L, S as in Samantha, R, v as in victor r dot com and then in the username field you want to enter your full sudden email address again so support at sutton dot com make sure you enter the at sutton dot com portion otherwise um, it will not go through and add the account for you properly even though the password is automatically entered here, remove it and re-enter your password. I'm going to re-enter mine now. And then once your password is entered there, you can scroll down to the outgoing mail server section. And the outgoing mail server name is the exact same as the incoming mail server. It's secure, S-E-C-U-R-E dot email e m a i l s r v r dot com again and then in the username field again you want to enter your full Sutton email address mine is support at Sutton dot com and then you want to enter your password one more time even though it says it's optional here it is not optional Okay, so my password is now entered fully. I have all of the interim information filled out here. Everything selected. And now you want to tap on next. It will tell you that it's verifying the account um, and it will bring you to this page. Then you want to tap on save. So I've tapped on save. And now you want to go back to your settings. So it's going to bring you back to the settings page. Tap on Sutton. And then you want to tap on account and then in here um, under advanced you want to tap on advanced and then under the mailbox behavior section here tap on drafts mailbox and then under on the server you want to tap on drafts so you scroll down through all of your different folders I have a lot of folders here um, and then you find the drafts folder um, and then you tap on that and then go back to advanced again. Now under the sent mail server, sent mailbox, sorry, under mailbox behaviors here, you tap on that. 
And then under on the server, you want to find the sent folder. Again, I have a ton of folders, so I'm going to scroll through them fast. We're going to find sent. Um, so you want to tap on sent, not sent items or sent messages, just the sent. And now go back to advanced again. In the deleted mailbox, you want to tap on that. And then under the deleted mailbox in the on the server section there, you want to scroll down and tap on trash. I'm going to scroll down and find trash here. So trash, tap on trash, go back to advanced again. And now um, everything is finished. You can go back to account one more time. So you want to tap on account on the top left and then tap done on the top right there. And everything will be finished. Then you can go back out of this, press your home button, and go back to your mail settings. So tap on your mail app up here, and your Sutton mailbox should show up there. You can tap on the Sutton mailbox, and you see a ton of emails in there, and it's all done. Thank you very much.